Philippines and I'm not racist. Well, racism upsets me and I think it's something everyone deals with. I mean, all of us struggle with these misconceptions and preconceptions that we might not know are there, but are, are there. And it's something we all need to work with, it's something we all need to face and, and confront. Something personally, which I thought was pretty powerful, was the first time I was actually ever in an all-black all neighborhood. I, was, I felt very uncomfortable. And I got back in the subway and was heading downtown, and I was trying to think why. Why? I mean, I, that, for absolutely no reason, I just felt uncomfortable. And it's something I sat and thought long and hard about, and there was absolutely no reason for it. I guess some of the imagery and some of the news I was brought up, they just inherently taught me to think that way, and it was wrong. And it was something I just thought it long and hard about, and I think something everyone needs to go through to challenge our, our preconceptions and how the world works. Well, not so much tied to that, but I just graduated from college last Sunday, and one of the, the key points that our speaker had was, there's no, there are no bounds to change a community can make when it's grounded in love. And that's something we all need to work towards. We need to just recognize everybody as they are, and focus on love. That's the way we're going to make the world change and make the world a better place.